doing today is we're going to be removing this coupler here there is there's probably a tool out there but we don't have that tool so what we're going to do is we're going to modify this harbor freight tool which i already started modifying it so what i'm doing is i'm opening up these holes to get closer to these so let me go ahead i'm using a drill bit also what i what you can use um to cut any metal or well aluminum metal these are aluminum bits so what i'm going to do is i'm going to start here slowly Turn that around. Got to send me a sponsor. So, this thing should be pretty hot. I mean, if it doesn't want to budge, I don't know how else to do it. Don't know. Pretty hot. I'm going to go hard for man. I'm going to go hard for man. If you do it, I'm going to Call me your slime, snake and not in the sand. Don't do no creases, but if I lift my shirt, might see that I'm I'ma go hard for man, I'ma go hard for man. If you was not bloodline, then you was not my cat. Call me your slime, snaking out of good sign. Don't do no creases, but if I lift my shoe, might see that I'm. Same niggas cleaning your gas, same niggas cleaning your gas, same niggas cleaning your rat, same niggas gon' rob you blind. Best to keep up your ass, no need to be surprised. Prepare for the worst, and when the niggas slide, leave them riding in the hearse. And that's just that you know what's next, we ballin', switch all next. Don't want your Uber like a Gucci get. Me Take away stress, then I neglect. Time to go give me a check. What a money. These bitches bad and nasty. I am not impressed, but I'ma say less. I made a commitment to money, got love for my trap and show what on my jam. You stay on the ground, would never get killed. Guess I'm done like coming straight out my tummy. Thought it was sweet, but he'll figure when phone them up that tummy. Shares falling like they clumsy. No breakup, we dump it. I'ma go hard for mine. I'ma go hard for mine. Bloodline, and you was not my cat. Do not call me your slime. Snake and not in the sand. Don't do no creases, but if I lift my shirt, might see that I'm. I'ma go hard for man. I'ma go hard for man. If you was not bloodline, then you was not my cat. Do not call me your slime. Snake and not in the sand. Don't do no creases, but if I lift my shirt, might see that I'm. If I knew better, I'd do better. Let so me get my screwdriver in and release us. And pull up on this housing because, like I said, it's pretty heavy. And there we are. Our twin screws. So, um, let me explain to you all how this kind of works. These things spin very fast off of your drive belt. And you know, uh, basically what it's doing is, as it's spinning, it's compressing air. Basically making it small enough and forcing more air faster through your engine to provide, you know, the engine with the air it needs. Um, we do, we are upgrading our pulley to a smaller pulley for this thing to spin faster. Um, but you know, spinning it faster is always not is not always the answer, because as you increase boost, you also increase. Anybody got the answer? Anybody got the answer? You increase heat. So, um, since we're spinning it faster, what we're going to be doing is basically we're going to be uh, pouring it in order for it to, you know, not max itself out or basically and just be spinning and not getting what it needs because some people go so small on pulleys to where the supercharger is actually you know maxed out to where it's less uh you know it performs work actually worse than what it did so what we're going to be doing is cleaning this thing up and it'll probably be on a later video uh clean this thing up and we're going to be porting this supercharger housing um, you all should be expecting that video, uh, 
if not the end of this week, the beginning of next week. And yeah, here you have your twin screws. So this shaft right here is what we just removed our pulley off of. Um, and this one is the driven. This is the driven pulley. So as this spins, as the engine RPMs go up, it spins fast. So, and we're not gonna be doing anything to this part right here. We're mainly gonna be addressing this here. So, you have the, okay, this is where the twin screws go into. You don't wanna mess with anything back here where the screws go into to mess up flow, but it's a couple things that you can do on the supercharger. Um, this style supercharger, it doesn't have the noise baffles that you see on other Edens, anything like that. So we don't have to try to optimize it for noise. Um, we don't have to try to cover those up. What we do need to do is probably smooth these transitions out to let the air come in better because it's a sharp edge. Um, air doesn't like sharp edges too much. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna smooth this transition out. Also, we're gonna be smoothing out this, this edge here. I don't know if you all can see it, but we're gonna be smoothing out this edge here. And we're gonna be probably up in this smiley face a little higher because we have the room to do it. And we're gonna be starting around, knocking down these edges. And this was kind of damaged with the, um, the part that I had here to stop it, but that's no problem because we're also gonna be knocking down this edge, this edge here, uh, smoothing this out as well, making that better. So that's the reason behind moving removing the screws. Um, also, you have bearings in here that, you know, sometimes they get bad because of um, blow by. So oil pretty much eats them up. And sometimes the bearings get no good on those seals here. I'm gonna go ahead and clean those up a little bit, make sure I don't have nothing there. So, all right, that's enough for the housing. So now,
crazy. I don't know if it's supposed to be this color, but I'm about to take it off. So, what we're gonna start doing first is, uh, let's see. I'm gonna knock down these edges really good. Uh, safety first. So, we're gonna be trying to knock down this hump right here uh, more. So, we can put more air over there. Found my pipes in the crib, a buck 80 She ain't say shit, she just told me she gon' pray for me I'm so deep up in the streets, the path can't even save me I don't care who ride with me, all I need is switching me All the tea, three PTs, sipping lean, get money, chasing cream by any means Hey, brand new SRT, it's a difference between you and me I ain't got no lease and I'm a wolf and I don't hang with sheep Bitch, I'm pistol P, you look boutique Bitch, I'm quick to squeeze, like my bitch up in them jeans Tweaking, it's a green, hit them with 50, get itchy, scratch the same I see them bodies in my dream, mama hate that I'm a fiend I can't stop abusing lean, trying to chase my dreams But I'm running from demons, man, I ain't running from shit Big ass blink on my hip, he trying to dip, but he trip Damn, laughing the shorty, he got hit all in this shit I know we pissed, don't go to clubs, but you can't book me in your shit I got a sack, then ran right to fifth, what I spent a brick Ran it up a hundred plus, thinking shit I ice my wrist Man, hell no, I'ma take that shit, put you on the bench, we'll play that shit We get your bitch and run around naked this shit Man, folks wanna train on that bitch, put a dub on the car, David Blaine this bitch I just made the whole thing disappear, I see a killer whenever I look in the mirror Folks cough from the back, gotta talk to the real Catch a guy bad, we a hit him, get rid of him I'm sick of him, I said my daughter gon' get him My shorty a bull pop, purse like they really in. He get the physical, put him out the picture Did on my own, but I came my niggas through all this pain Lil' nigga, we did it I don't really rich, just tryna get rich Boy, fuck all the Oscars, shit, shot to some ninja I ain't with all that dick, I made a debut, my witness Snakes in the grass, I can hit that ass here So be in the back with that beat me on beam You know I'm 10 for 10, I ain't doing no mess Keep on 